let's take a look at the Software 8 screen to understand where things are located. The menu bar has drop-down menus to access features that can also be accessed with shortcut icons or shortcut keys. The toolbars are located at the top and the bottom of the design screen. The Canvas toolbar has four icons. First of all, Artwork Canvas is the icon that will take you to Corel Draw. Next is the Embroidery Canvas, and the design screen opens to the Embroidery Canvas. Next is the Embroidery Library, which is the design management system that will be covered in a future video. The Convert Embroidery to Artwork icon takes a design that you have on screen and will convert it to a vector drawing. The General Toolbar has basic Windows icons, such as Cut, Copy, and Paste, and icons that launch special dialog boxes or Docker boxes within the software. Next is the Zoom Toolbar to change the level of zoom in the design. Pan is also part of this toolbar and can be used to move the design on screen. The Travel Toolbar is the last toolbar in the first row of toolbars, and this is used to travel stitch by stitch, object for object, or color by color in a design. The Transform Toolbar is the first toolbar in the second row, and these icons are used to edit your design. The View Toolbar has icons that will change what you see on your screen. At the bottom of the design screen is the Stitch Toolbar, and you'll find different outline, fill, and effects in this toolbar. The Colored Toolbar is just underneath the Stitch Toolbar, and you use this toolbar to change the colors in the design. The Status Toolbar is at the very bottom of the screen and gives you information about the size, location, and number of stitches in the design. Toolboxes are located on the left side of the screen, and each toolbox has several different icons within the general category. You access the toolbox simply by clicking on that toolbox. You have scroll arrows that will take you through the icons. On the right side of the screen, you will find Docker tabs that open special dialog boxes for different functions in the software. Notice the dotted lines in front of the toolbars. This means that the toolbars can be moved on the design screen and positioned as desired. You simply click and drag, and you can place the, the toolbar wherever you want it. If you want it to go back in place, simply click and drag it back into place. 